seats. No care for the IG, this no care for the IG. Hey guys, so today we're working with Nadula hair as y'all seen in the previous clip. Your girl slayed that V part and got it looking like a natural sewing, gluing, whatever. But it's a V part and it's something you could pop right on and off. So as y'all see, I'm always going to show y'all what's up in the goodie box because y'all will be getting the same thing when you place your order. I love how this wig have the breathable cap in the inside. It just makes it more flexible and gets you that more soft, natural, short look. So I did go in and dye the hair jet black because it's gonna it's gonna need to match my hair color, y'all. My hair color is pretty dark, and I love a jet black look. So I did the watercolor method on this. I feel like when you're doing black, it's so much easier. As y'all see, look how dark it came out. So I did want to show you guys when you're parting your hair with the V part, you want to make sure you're doing your leave out in a V type way because if you do it in a normal square type way or whatever you'll do for like a sewing your tracks is going to show so you want to make sure you're doing it in a v position so when you place it down it could just all flow naturally so of course since i went ahead and dyed the hair as y'all see this is how it looks just air dried i just let the wig air dry overnight and you guys see it's just a straight look to it it's not no natting up or anything like it that. looks exactly the same it just doesn't have that body wave to it no more and then it's just black to match my hair so that's one thing another thing i loved about this hair it was very easy to manage it wasn't one of those hairs where it's after you wet it it's just going like no it was good all i had to do was go in a little bit with my flat iron so i am going in with the lightweight spray because you don't want to do too much i could have went more lightweight with it but i did spray it on each individual individual part and as y'all could see i just went over like a few times with my flat iron but y'all seen that first time i went over it got it silky straight now that we're at the top look how silky and bouncy this hair is like it just flows so perfect like i didn't have to do too much to it and i love a hair that i don't have to do too much and it just give it that that uh like y'all see how it looks just so bomb so now of course we're gonna have to get ready to blending my hair which didn't take that much to do either so i'm going to show you guys the products that i used as well but first y'all already know i got to make sure i do each side of the wig and get it super flat and you already see like it really looks like i got a sewing you couldn't tell me that i didn't it's just more time being saved and you don't have to worry about the stress on your hair from the thread for my hair, I'm just going in with a heat protectant, like a little oil, something to protect my hair from the heat because, of course, I don't want to be having to keep going in or get that heat damage. I already need my ends clip, but at least I don't have too much heat damage because when I wet my hair, it still goes back to the texture that I like. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. So y'all see, I'm just parting out my part so I could get my middle part going. I wanted to do a side part because I thought it would have been so cute, but I'm like, I think I'm due for a middle part. And plus, I wanted to do something real quick and easy to just get on the go. So as y'all can see right here, that's pretty much what I'm doing. It's about to blend my hair with this wig. y'all i have to come back in to let y'all know on and off the court don't judge me i'm not the best when it comes down to my edges but i feel like i just do a cool job but i love like using 
eco style gel and edge control to do my edges i feel like it lays down so much better and it's easier for me to just like play with so i do like to go in with my gel first and then i go in with the edge control just to like have a little hold because the gel is slicks it and stuff but i like it to still have that like hold so i don't know i think i don't know but i feel like this combo is just like the best for me like it just goes in so perfect like it's just so much easier to brush So as y'all can see y'all this is the finished look I went ahead and blended it and I went and went more in with my edges off camera because y'all like I said it take me a minute so this is the hair I like it it's super flowy and just my hair was easy to blend with it everything will be listed down in the description box below the exact link to this hair don't forget to go shop Nadula hair also look at the description box because there will be extra goodies in there for you guys as well thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video